I'm here. You better, you better make a delicious treat. You know what, actually, these taste terrible. You don't get a halo, it's terrible. Hello, human, Cybernova here. And as I went to log into the game today to do an intro for some other tea, you guys, we have some major tea. So we obviously have a new screen here and I wanna kind of explain what this is directly from Barbie. So Barbie was mentioning right after the release that they were working on some glitches and a new starting screen since previously you would start in an apartment and have to teleport all over the place. So they thought, you know, let's simplify it. Let's make a new start screen. And sure enough, they got it made really quickly. Thank you, Ice Overlord, our alien king for getting this up for us. So now he is working on something for VIP servers as well. We'll get to that in a minute. So here's the brand new load screen, everybody. And I'm very excited about this because I think not only do I love it that we can see that somebody is almost level 9,000, which is absolutely crazy. Like we're never gonna talk about my level ever again on this channel. It shows you your diamonds here. It shows you royal high. Like, can I get a PNG of that beautiful logo? I also like how your cell phone is here. It shows you some events. And then of course, a quest. So uh, I definitely have a lot of stuff to catch up on, but this is what makes me the most excited. So you guys see this explore the world. Now, right directly when you log into the game, it brings you to a load screen where you can teleport anywhere you need to go, including Fantasia, Enchantix, Royal High Apartment Sunset, and Divinia. And not even just Divinia, you can specifically teleport just to archery. So I love that now this will kind of remind me to do my login rewards, which I desperately need to do. So we're gonna do that now. But Barbie was also mentioning that Ice was working working on a fix. So right here, she has a tweet about it. You know how if you follow your friend into a different realm while in a VIP server, you have to follow each other immediately or else it will put you in different servers entirely. We really want to fix this. So this was yesterday and today I saw Ice working on something called Test 13. So this is very mysterious, but I'm guessing based on the timing, okay, so this happened a day after Barbie tweeted that this could be that fix that we are looking for. And I'm not 100% certain, but that's just my little guess, okay? So is it T? I don't know, but Test 13 is the new Area 51 conspiracy. Okay guys, so there's Ice. There's you go ice so boom there's some hot spicy tea for you okay don't judge me i'm in my regular roblox outfit to remind you guys i still have my beautiful galaxy ugc dress and i wanted to wear it for this video because the new roblox accessory matches it so well but there we go guys i finally did my login reward let's get back to spilling tea oh my goodness i was not expecting all of this so we got a little bt I feel like we need a BT theme song at this point because she smells so much amazing tea. But apparently, even though she just pumped out an entire arc update. Look guys, B is not taking a day off. Look at this. Took a day to relax and enjoy your edits of the park, but it's back to grind. What do you want to see in the park next? Gears? So she goes on through this tweet to kind of list off some stuff you guys might want, like animals, animals, bugs, animations, transportation, mini games. And so I just, I need to breathe for a second here, you guys. I need to breathe because I was not expecting this much tea. I was like, oh, we're just gonna, we're gonna spill a little tea. Just go see what B's up to. Oh my gosh. But you guys, there is more. Look at this. Welcome to B Video. I, I thought that was fireflies. I don't even know what I thought it was fireworks, but it's all bees. So I don't know if this is a particle effect. I don't know if this is gonna randomly spawn in the world. Like maybe if you go in a certain bush, you can get some bees to follow you, but instead of them hurting you, it's a particle effect. I don't know. I don't know. I have so many ideas. I love the bees. Who else is excited? Leave a like if you're so excited. Whoa, but then it gets even better because look at what beeism did. She literally already added a bee spawner. So guys, add Asking you shall receive. I have to say, can we all just be so appreciative of Beeism? Because basically all of the crazy ideas that we all tweet about, even if we're joking or just having fun, a lot of this stuff ends up in the game. So you guys, I'm, I'm super excited. I stand the bees. And then you guys, seriously, I don't, I don't know what this is. I don't know if they played a fake Royal High game here, but it's showing Royal High in a weird description. Okay, so check this out, you guys. It shows 64,000 people playing. So it looks like the real Royal High. It says chickens, potatoes, and potatoes and onions. <laughs> Yay. Wait, what? Chickens and potatoes and onions. Yay. Did anybody else see this? Are we being trolled? I don't know what's going on here. So now that we have this new update with the new load screen, it reminded me that I still have a lot of stuff to 
to do. I have a lot of realms to explore to finish what I need to do for my daily login rewards and such. But you guys, we have some more news for Mrs. Kate Ka. And we know that Kate Ka is in charge of all of the stories that go into the fountains. She is an amazing writer, so it's really fun to see what stories make it in. I know I can't wait to go to the fountain and see a new story, hopefully. But she did do a new contest. So I don't know if you guys saw earlier, this was a form for St. Patrick's Day stories, which like, hello, I'm still not even over Valentine's Day and we're already thinking about St. Patrick's Day, but there was a Google Doc. So here is the form. It's basically talking all about the contest and there are gonna be anywhere from five to 10 stories chosen for this holiday. So not only will your story end up in the game, but there are gonna be some special prizes for those lucky winners. You will get a special in-game writer's badge. And then there are only 500 max submissions and one entry per writer. So it looked like even with those little rules for entering, they still read 500 submissions pretty fast. Actually, the screenshot says 505. So you guys, I am wondering, did any of you guys submit stories? Do you know anybody who did? Let me know in the comments. Just gonna try prize wave two. We don't have a new prize wave in the wheel yet. I don't know if that is coming. I am guessing that maybe with St. Patrick's Day, we might get to see that. But you guys, just as in case, you know, oh, we did land on a chest. Ooh, a fluent aristocrat. I am telling you guys, if you want to try to get some accessories and you have not been having luck, go to my haunted server because I've been having a ton of luck there. And uh, as you guys can see, there is the affluent aristocrat hat. I just won the wind up toy. I won the tail recently. So we've been getting a lot of really good stuff. All right, so I was actually checking out the RHT spill hashtag and I came across something amazing by Unix over here that I had no idea you can do. So it shows a screenshot of a prince sitting on the edge of the fountain. Like, hello, I need to go to the fountain. I wanna go try this out. Woo, okay. So we are actually gonna go head to Davinia Park right now. Check out the fountain. Here we are. The fountain is straight ahead, so it's really easy to get to you guys. Okay, and I'm gonna try to sit on the side. Also, I'm just so glad Fountain Girl is back. Nothing felt the same without you. Oh my gosh, you can! <gasps> so every spot on the fountain probably has a different animation. So let's see where you can sit over here. Oh, okay, so that's the same side. How do I sit inside? I wanna look at the fountain. Oh, I don't know what he did. He must have had some pose on. But anyways, really cool. I did not know you could sit here. We're gonna sit here while we go to the fountain today. Okay, this is exciting. Make a wish. <gasps> what, are we, what are we gonna wish for? today. Oh, look, she just had a cool animation. She was like leaning over the side. That's pretty cool. Oh my gosh. Okay. So I've actually gotten this story before. This is a story about royal high influencers. We go up to a curly haired girl dressed in purple to ask what's going on. Okay. So I think, I think we would like to help by, let's prepare some desserts. I don't know. That sounds fun. I want to bake something. Let's bake something. Making desserts is right up your alley. So you go up to pastry chef Ash. Oh my gosh, Ash, wait. I'm here. You better, you better make a delicious treat. You know what, Ashley? These taste terrible. You don't get a halo. It's terrible. Oh, okay. Well, if it's so bad, why'd you give me that many diamonds, Ash? So here we are hanging over the edge, getting our money from Ash, even though he, he hated our baking. It's okay. We still got paid. But guys, this has been very, very exciting. Definitely let me know in the comments what you guys think about all this tea. Sorry I missed the tea yesterday. Like I said, I have so much stuff going on right now. I have projects in the works that you guys are going to see very, very soon. I just have a lot of stuff. Also, guys, I did just get confirmation that I can put another item in UGC. So let me know. Do you guys want me to start doing like a historically accurate set? Do you want all alien stuff? Like, do you want something cute? Like a little baby basil? I don't know. Leave a comment. Let me know what you guys are thinking because obviously I want you guys to love it as much as you guys loved this first UGC. Thank you, Johnny Soleil. And guys, definitely keep me posted in the RHT spill hashtag. I used that today. The video, I'm checking it a lot more and I love it seeing all of the tea. It's so exciting. We have so much more tea coming up. Let me know what you think about all this. I'll see you in the next video, human. Goodbye.
Asada. Fish taco, shrimp tacos, or carne asada. When I see a taco truck, you know I gotta follow. Hey, give me all of that. Tacos, where you at? I love tacos, it's a fact. Got it tatted on my back. <laughs> you know it's my favorite. It tastes so